a full moon meditation for galactic chakra activation, reconnecting your divine feminine and divine masculine, a wisdom teaching from the Intergalactic Alliance of Light Beings, brought to you by WhatComesNextForYou.com, channeled for you by Canadian psychic medium and multidimensional channel, Tracy Milne. Greetings, dear Earth Star Angel. The following exercise has been designed to help you harness the full moon energies for the purpose of co-creation on an etheric and quantum level. Please use the moon's imaging and light source to amplify your session. If you can't see the full moon physically, focus on the images presented in this video as much as needed in order for you to activate and actualize your visualization. This exercise will help to serve you to clear, open, align, and rebalance yourself in order to bring in balance to your divine feminine and divine masculine expressions. The dark has hijacked these programs, taking them to the extreme and making it difficult for all star seeds and earth star angels to simply accept themselves and their good qualities in order to work their light to their highest capacity. It does not matter if you're currently incarnated as a woman or a man. Each Earth Star human has a blend of both of these divine energies as well as everything else within your 3D reality. This exercise will give you a greater sense of balance in the days and weeks ahead, helping you to become more drama-proof, as well as to help you anchor in energies like calm, patience, and compassion. These energies, once anchored, can then be spread throughout Gaia's grids and be received by any and all who choose to request support in this area. We recommend you use our voice as an anchor for this now time and a guide but fill in your own blanks as you see fit. This is not meant to be a passive exercise and your ability to envision or fantasize will be just the ticket for getting this job done to the highest success rate. So when you're ready to begin, find a comfortable place to sit where you can keep your feet on the ground and see the full moon if possible. If not, simply use the pictures in the video to tap into the full moon energy and then focus on grounding your body in the now by taking a few deep breaths in and out as you begin to focus on relaxing your body tuning in to my voice breathe in and claim your body mind spirit complex as sacred space then breathe out and create a beautiful bubble of energy around your body, claiming this too as sacred space. Ask that only truth, love, and light be allowed to come near you as you do your work on this day. Breathe in and imagine sending out a telepathic call to your intergalactic guide team member. Breathe out and see this call going out to your guide bringing them into the room where you are, where they materialize very close to where your body is currently resting. State your intention to balance your divine feminine and divine masculine qualities in order to anchor this new balanced energy into the grids of earth and feel your guide accepting this call to help you aligning you with everything that you will need, beginning with placing your star cloak around your shoulders. Feel it move around your body, adding additional protection, amplification, and manifestation ease while you do your work. Now focusing on the light of the full moon, with your next breath in, breathe that full moon light into your body and pull it down through your head, into your heart, and then down to anchor into your sacral or belly button chakra. Here is where your creative juices mix and mingle 
with your divine desires, your divine thoughts, and your divine inspirations. This is where your divine feminine energy lives and rests. Breathe in and out here as you focus on creating a magnificent orange multi-petaled flower. As you breathe in, breathe in an acceptance of your beautiful, balanced, divine feminine qualities. Accept that you are an intuitive being. Accept that you are a trusting and creative being. Accept that you are a strong and boundless being. And allow these new energies to come in and become your new truth. With each breath out, breathe out old insecurities, old uncertainties and old limitations you've placed around your divine feminine energy. See this old energy leaving your body, clearing pockets of trauma and karma carried through lifetimes to be healed in this now. And when you feel you have breathed out all unwanted energy and breathed in all balanced new acceptance of existing energy, envision brightening your flower before sending this orange beam up your body through your chakras and set it to rest on the left side of your face just beside your left eye. See this as a beautiful tattoo of an orange flower growing or glowing there. Breathe softly for a moment and say a prayer for all of the daughters of earth what would you like to see return to the feminine expression on this planet? How would you like to help? What kind of love do you think the divine feminine expression needs right now? Imagine connecting to the energies of the moon and pulling these down through your body, through your legs, past your feet and into the ground to be activated as pure potential possibilities for you and all other beings wishing to tap into the divine feminine energy. Breathe in and breathe out until you feel this has been accomplished and create a second flower in the ground below your feet. Next, we ask you to bring your focus up to your head where your crown chakra is. Envision a beautiful tube or beam of light traveling up from the center of your head to plug in first to what you perceive as your higher self before moving up into what you perceive as your galactic self. See yourself plugging into this energy and feel your beautiful connection move back down through the heavens, through your higher self and into your head. See this create a beautiful crown around the top of your head and claim your crown chakra as sacred space, as your sacred connection to the divine masculine energies that connect you with source and your intuitive knowing. With each breath in, reclaim your balanced divine masculine qualities, your ability to be deeply present in the now to be honest, to be accountable, to be focused and logical, to be confident and protective, to be secure and responsible, to be humble and fun. And with each breath out, breathe out your need to be controlling, suspicious, unstable, insecure, withdrawn or aggressive. Do this until you feel all unwanted energy has been sent out of your body. Now pull in the light from the moon. Pull in your desire to reflect balanced divine masculine qualities. Remember and honor your ability to take progressive, positive, protective, kind-hearted, inspired action as you need it. Honor this and then create a beautiful silver flower and move this to 
the right side of your face, just beside your right eye. Now bring your attention to your third eye and travel down until you've reached the spot between your eyebrows, just above your nose. This is where your fourth eye, or galactic chakra, lies. See this as an energy resting gently in this space and give it a moonstone quality. Into this moonstone, you are going to pull your orange flower representing your divine feminine and your silver flower representing your divine masculine. And you are going to marry them in the spot of your fourth eye or galactic chakra. See your divine feminine and your divine masculine become joined in a twin flame energy that is very supportive, co-creative, loving, and non-judgmental. Breathe in and breathe out as you feel this new connection come online. How does this self-acceptance feel? Is this something that you would like the rest of the world to feel and appreciate? If so, focus once more on the top of your head, pulling in the full moon energies down through your crown, blending them first with your third eye purple before sending them down into your fourth eye moonstone. Let them build up energy here, creating a ball of light that then moves into your body, traveling down your chakra systems, adding a blend of pure words to help make clear communication, a blend of pure love and compassion to help for greater understanding between all the men and women of planet Earth a pure belief that it is possible for a new, more cooperative vibration to be established between the men and women of Earth. A new creative fire and creative juice that helps us want to join with each other, helps us magnetize to working together in divine complement of each other. And then a beautiful red energy to help us take inspired action as needed to help us step into our true power as divine beings, as unique and blissful, creative, genius energies in the form of a human star angel. Send this down through your legs, through your feet, and into the grids of Gaia. See this gold, orange, and silver energy mixing and mingling with the crystal grid work below your feet and breathe in and breathe out, feeling yourself the conduit between heaven and earth. Do this until you feel you have sent all the love and light you wish to send today into the grids of Gaia. Feel the connection between your Divine Masculine and Divine Feminine. Feel your balanced, opened, aligned energy and know that you have done very powerful light work on this day. Now bring your focus back up your body, through your torso, past your throat, through your head, back up beyond your third eye until you become aware once again of your crown chakra. Take a few more deep breaths in and out and then pull in that protective circle. Give back your robe of stars. Thank your guide team for working with you today. And when you are ready, open your eyes and go on about your evening or your day. We thank you for taking the time to do this exercise. You have helped many you will never know. Until next time, in the greatest light of love and truth, on behalf of the Intergalactic Alliance of Light Beings, I am Chimera Namaste. Brought to you by whatcomesnextforyou.com. What's in your future?